Milwaukee public school teachers and staff tested positive for COVID over the weekend, leading to at least a temporary return to virtual learning this week. Roughly 17 percent tested positive, and school board president Bob Peterson says there are more new cases. Based on our dashboard, there was 130 new cases today, both of staff, including staff and students. MPS tested more than 2,400 teachers and staff Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. The final tally will be revealed during a special school board meeting tonight. We um, took the time and made the effort to base our decision on, on, on real data, not just uh, competing arguments on both sides. I asked the question the parents of nearly 70,000 MPS students want to know. Will Milwaukee Public Schools more than likely be back in person by Monday. We will know that by the end of the meeting tonight. Aurora Dr. Frank Belmonte is the chief medical officer for Advocate Children's Hospital near Chicago and says there have not been major COVID outbreaks in schools. It is really important for us to keep kids in school. Uh, we know we know what the deleterious side effects were from last year in remote learning. So we should do, be doing everything in our power to keep kids in school. Um, and do it safely. Whatever decision we make, I'm sure there'll be um, people very disappointed and people very happy. Well, Terry, beyond last weekend's testing, what other mitigation efforts can Milwaukee Public Schools take? The school board president says they've purchased better KN95 masks for all teachers and all students to better protect them. But again, the numbers just weren't there at the beginning of this week. We'll see what those final results show tonight.